friends. Welcome to Sunday Seeds for the Saplings program. I am Miss Rachel for St. Stephen Lutheran Church. Happy Easter! But Miss Rachel, Easter was last Sunday. Hmm. Nope, it's still Easter. There are 55 zero days in Easter. It is a whole season that we have for celebrating. Hallelujah, hallelujah, he is risen. He is risen indeed. He is risen. He is risen indeed. All right, my friends, welcome. Today, we're gonna talk about sharing from the book of Acts in our World Storybook Bible. And it says, share everything. And here are our friends with their offerings. The first Christians were believers who started forming church families. Men and women, boys and girls, and all the people were eager to learn about Jesus together. Jesus wants us to love each other, one believer said. And he said that we should love others like God loves us. Very big, love others as God loves us. The people in the church family agreed and they worked hard to show love to everyone. What about sharing, asked a little boy. Jesus taught us to share everything, an older man said. He told his followers to share with the people in need. Well, what could we share, asked a woman. The believers shared with each other and now they looked for ways to share with people outside of their church family. Ada says, the first Christians didn't call themselves Christians. They called themselves believers. The little boy ran into his room holding a pair of sandals. He said, these are too small for me. We can share them with another boy. And the young girl held out a small bundle of bread. And she said, we baked this morning. We can share this bread with someone who is hungry. And a man laid a hammer and nails on the table. We have tools for building. We can share with people who need things fixed. The believers gave away all kinds of things, clothing, food, and money too, to every believer. Someone found something important to share inside their church family and outside their church family. I could share my food and probably my video games, says Otto, but Jesus doesn't even want me to share my limited edition action figures, does he? Hmm, yes, Otto, Ada tells him. Jesus wants us to share everything, even your limited edition action figure collection. Now, does that mean that Otto has to give away his action figures? No. It doesn't. Does that mean that, um, so what does it mean? He could share it by playing with someone, right? Yes, and sharing it while they play. That's a very good thing. So you could share your toys. You should, could share some of your Easter candy if you still have some of that left. Um, if some of you had an experience at our Holy Week walk a couple weekends ago for Palm Sunday, our Palm Passion Weekend, the Holy Week walk was a sharing of talents and time from many of our church friends, our fellow believers. Wally Nelson built us an amazing table to nail our prayers at the foot of the cross. And Miss uh, Kathy Lund helped us by sharing her art abilities with Miss Jordan and Miss Nancy at the art tent. We had friends with their amazing knowledge, the Lurees, to bring you and welcome you in from your palm walk. Also, ooh, those palms all the palms that people walked in on, those were shared with us by one Mr. Nick Menand. Thank you, friends. Thank you, all of you. Oh, the garden group. If you haven't seen our butterfly garden, I hope that you have a chance to come by campus. It's positively beautiful. And all of those wonderful people have shared their abilities of planting and nurturing so that we may have a lovely sanctuary space outside. All right, let's see, my friends, something you could share. But Miss Rachel, we already got rid of our clothes for this season. Hmm, I don't have extra toys because I shared those too. Okay, do you have any special abilities? Something that you enjoy doing? Maybe you like to sing. Maybe you like to dance. Maybe you're really good at math and you could share those skills with someone who doesn't quite understand it as well. There are always new and exciting ways, my friend, that you can share your gifts in the kingdom of God. 
All right, my friends? So, happy second week of Easter. We have a long road of celebration ahead of us, and I'm so grateful that you're here with us today. This is gonna be a quick one, because today we are blessed. I am getting to share my abilities and my knowledge of Lutheranism for Open Communion class, and I feel very blessed to do so. Oh, colors. Lent was purple. Easter is white and gold. Very good, my friends. All right. So, hmm, let us pray. Dear God, it's us. Thank you for all the gifts, the physical ones and the talents and all the things that we can share with our family, with our friends, with strangers, and with all of the world around us. Thank you, God, for our blessings and thank you for others with whom we share. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Mwah. Jesus loves you and so do I. Have a great week, friends.